Uzra Lali has been working in Banyan province for 15 years. She turned a $2,500 investment into a growing business that today employs 50 women. Her goal is to create jobs, but also promote the unique crafts and designs of Banyan province. We make shoes, bags, carpets and socks from sheep wool and use traditional designs. Her company is expanding, and now it sells products in Kabul, Jalalabad, and even outside Afghanistan. Those women who are working in the company are saying delightedly that now they can support their families. It's not much money, but for these women, it's enough to create a life. It is good. I come here and I am paid $25 monthly, which lets me take care of my children. It keeps me busy and I learn something new. It is good for us. We have work and it keeps us busy. The payment is sufficient for our family's expenses. Chinese products are their main competition, but Lolly's products are less expensive than mass-produced imports. Each pair of shoes and bags with high quality are being sold for 2.5 U.S. dollars by our company, while shoes and bags made in China cost more. The products compete in the marketplace. Lolly says her challenges are routine power outages and lack of government support. For Zafar Bamyani in Bamyan, Afghanistan, Kevin Enix, BOA News.